guys, what is going on? It is Obadiah, and today we are back on the island playing some Extinction Core Arc. So, what I want to do today, I, we had to do a little bit of building, but I can't do it just yet. So, we had a raptor spawn on our base, and it went and murdered, like, our parasaur and our turtles, and it was just a huge, terrible nightmare. <sighs> so, now I want to go ahead and build, I think, some kind of dino barn. Oh, hey, by the, ooh, good thing I went in K-mode, because I think it's going to come kill me. <laughs> See what I'm talking about with these spawns? Die! 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 Who else is here? Some more dillos? Wait, what am I thinking? We could use a couple dillos. You're knocked out. Ooh! Oh, you spit in my face. You're knocked out. Turtle? Heck yeah, you're knocked out. Who else we got? Okay, I need this thing to go away so I can see. There was another one, right? Yeah. How does it feel to get shot like that when... Ugh, okay. So frustrating. All right. Um, so we want to start a kibble farm. We want to make a dino barn. If you guys do enjoy these videos, if you learned something, do me a favor and hit that thumbs up button. And of course, feel free to subscribe and share. So I'm going to get some meat on these guys. Just kind of let them do their tame up thing. I should have plenty of meat in the... Uh, ah, there we go. In here. And then let's just do like, I don't know, 5, 10, 15, 20. Should be more than enough. Yeah, you're probably gonna take two. Five, ten, and they're level 12, level 12, level 12. And I am out of water, so I need to stop getting some of that. So we need a kibble farm. So I wanna do some building. I wanna start a greenhouse. I want to start a dino barn. Is it all of them or am I missing one? I don't want one to wake up, but I guess those guys will protect it. Look at that, already done. Um, but I was flying around and I saw an alpha Enki and I want us to go get that first So we're not gonna miss out on that. I didn't check the level I just saw it and was like I gotta go get my Quetzal. So now I'm here and I'm getting the Quetzal. We're gonna stop and get some water We're gonna go over and find where this Enki was and then we are gonna tame that sucker up All right as soon as we left our base we ran into an alpha Carno now It's only level 44. So it's nothing. What get out of here trike. So it's nothing special but even though our last one died, we're able to recover cover the saddle. And so we already have a saddle made. So we're like, hey, we've got the kibble. We've got the saddle. Let's tame this sucker. And our taming pen is right here. So, oh man, stop eating me. Get in the pen. Yeah, get in the pen. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and knock this sucker out first. And, oh, what else is in there? Can you come kill this little guy? Eat him. Eat him. Uh, I don't want that little guy to eat him or, when he's knocked out. All right, so we're going to go ahead and knock this sucker out. And then we'll go get that Alpha Inky and hope it's still there. Okay, this guy should be going down any second now, I think. Let's drop one in, one more into him and then let's check it. I do love having this Omnocular and be able to check. Oh, it's going up. We're at 14, 15,000. Let's go ahead and drop another one in there just to be safe. Oh, come on. Come on. And... Get it! Okay, now for some reason I can't see it. Oh, there it is. Oh, it's going down! <laughs> we stopped too long. There we go. All right. This whole wanting to, like, see and know thing is actually being kind of a pain in the butt. All right, that should be it for sure. Let's check. There we go. 17. It's going up. And so he should knock out, and then we should be able to run down there really... Oh, crap. One more. All right, I should just do it. I should just keep hammering airs into him. I don't know why I keep stopping. And go down. And go down. Thank you. Jeez, what is your problem, dude? All right, what's this Dillo? Come here. All right, he's knocked out. Ooh, it's a 92. We will tame that up. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and throw the uh, kibble and narcotics on the guy and get this guy tamed up. All right, so the Alpha Enki is right here. And what level is it? Level 80, okay, that's not too bad. Uh, I have no idea how much kibble that takes. We have like 20 Dillo kibble, so we should be fine. Whoa, 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 stop beating on me, bud. Why Why, the, how do, why do Enkis have a bleed attack? Oh man, we might have to take this guy back home in stages. Come on, I really don't wanna drop him in the taming pen with him being this remarkably aggressive. All right, you're gonna have to chill right there holy crap he beat the hell out of me all right i'm gonna heal this guy up and then we're gonna go grab it again and get it, that sucker back in the taming pen he is aggressive all right we're going back in let's grab it and please don't beat me up 
Oh, now he's not attacking. Oh, no, he's attacking. Come on, come on, come on. Get, just get a lot closer. <laughs> if we have to take a third trip, we will. I'm nervous about dropping him in the taming pen, though, because I don't want him to beat up our brand new fancy Carno who's taming up in there. Uh, I mean, I guess I'm gonna. Oh. Ooh. I didn't drop you. I'm dropping you. I'm dropping you. I'm dropping you. Oh. Oh. Let's eat this food. <laughs> Ooh, we were really close to death. <laughs> All right. Let our health go back up, and we are so close to the taming bed, we should be able to get him right there. Oh, is that an alpha raptor? Or just a regular old raptor? Just a regular old raptor. All right, trip three, and we're just gonna have to drop him in the taming pen. That Carno really is not as useful as this. I have not yet seen another Alpha Anki, and that is the second Alpha Carno that I've seen. Let's drop this sucker right there. Let's get a little lower and see if we can just shoot it from right here. Oh, you can't hit me, can you? Oh, you sure can. Let's go up a little bit and let's go on this side. Come on, bud, follow me over. Oh, wow, he's doing a lot of damage. There we go. Now we should be at a nice, safe distance. Can we hit him from here? Sure can. Come on over, bud. Get right underneath us if you have to. Oh no, I didn't mean it. Don't really get right underneath us. Uh, that's actually not the best area for you to be in. I can't actually see you. So can you go elsewhere, please? Uh. No? Uh. There it is. Perfect. Oh no, get stuck on the rock. If I fall off my quets, we are in trouble. Perfect. Okay, if he can just stay right there the whole time, we should get this guy down, no problem. All right, this guy's got to be going down at this point. I mean, come on. We got to be real close. All right, we'll do one more hit, maybe two. Uh-oh, it's not registering all of a sudden. What are we at? 27, and it's going up. Okay, so we're close. We're close. Make, the, make, make this process go a little faster. There you go. Now you've got to be out. And it's out. Awesome, all right, so let's go check on the Carno, check on the Yankee, get some kibble and some narcotics on both of them. Ah, okay, hop off properly. How are you doing? Ooh, you're almost done. And is your torpor, torpor still going up? Okay, we'll go ahead and check on this guy and then we should be good to go. All right, and the Carno tamed up and I already took some kibble off. Oh, got ate the rest of the kibble, okay. It's a good thing I took some of it off. Came out level 65. <laughs> Only 17,000 health, not quite as good as our last guy. It was much, much higher, but we already had the saddle, so I figure we can't really pass it up. All right, so now all we have to do is wait on this Anki, who has some time, and then we can start actually gathering stuff to do some cool building. All right, guys, so someone called out that they had found an Alpha Doid, and they were not going to tame it, because they did not have the kibble, so offered it up to me. And I know we already have an Alpha Doid. It's true, but this one's a level 112. And are you really gonna turn down a 112 Alpha Doa just because you happen to already have a Doed? I don't think so. I think we might just have barely enough kibble to tame it, I hope. Um, if it looks like it's not, we're gonna go kill a bunch of tribes people because that drops pretty quick, pretty easy. Um, oh, really? Oh, well, that's weird. It hit my quets and the guy took the damage. Okay, we just need to find just the right spot right there and we're just gonna hammer into this guy and oh this is such a good taming day already we just did uh do some work on the spawns and the i and i and i can already tell it's amazing all right this guy should be going down and there it is he's down awesome so we're ahead and throw the kibble and narcotics on him check our other guy and man hopefully taming day keeps going awesome like this for the rest of the day all right, guys, we are back to base. We have the Enki tamed up. We have the Doed tamed up. We have the Carno tamed up. And I've already went ahead and took the Enki and the Doed out and went and got a ton of resources and made a bunch of crafting things. Oh, I also found that turkeys can harvest thatch pretty decently. So I got some of that. Um, so I've already been building up a ton of stuff and it's time to start making ourselves a dino pen so that random Dillos and Raptors stop spawning in my base and killing stuff all the dang time, it's a huge pain. I've already went ahead and laid down the first foundation all the way over here. Um, I kinda tried to line it up a little bit. I plan on making this thing pretty sizable, I think. Uh, let's see how big we can make it. One, two, let's go maybe three, four back on this side. Can we go all, yeah, that's probably about, about that. Now we'll go all the way back, five that way and i'm gonna go ahead and build it out this way as well i'm gonna get the foundation all laid and whatnot and then i will bring y'all back all right guys so i got the foundation 
laid and it is going to be one ugly building but it's pretty dang big i'm pretty happy with the size it took a lot of resources a lot a lot of resources um and i actually need to go gather more i'm almost out i gathered an absolute ton and then went and gathered more and now i'm almost out again um i do have a bunch of walls and stuff already built so we're gonna go ahead and put some of that down let me see actually what do we got so I want there to be a behemoth gate for the door, and I already have one of those built. Where is that sucker? Behemoth gateway. Let's go ahead and try to snap that, and then we've got some large walls. Um, extra large walls. We have a ton of them. So, we can only carry like five or six at a time. Yeah, six. So, uh, with structures plus, they have these walls. They've got walls that are large and extra large. Large walls are four high, which is fantastic, and the extra large walls are 12 high, which is even more fantasticer. So let's go ahead and check this out, see if we can get this gate to snap and hope, oh, I hope I measured correctly. I hope I did this right and it's not gonna be off center. Please work. Okay, let's do this. Hey, it's not snapping. It's supposed to snap. It's okay, I would actually rather have it not snap, but. Uh, wow, did I just line that up pretty well on the first try? Looks a little off. Let me do a little bit of that. Maybe a little bit more of that. A little bit less. Yeah, that looks pretty good. I'm really surprised it's not snapping. I guess we'll put it all the way out here like this. And is it lined up on the sides? A little gap on that side. A little gap on that side. Beautiful. So yeah, awesome. So just like I had planned it, ooh, I'm so weighted down. There is, uh, perfect, I'm gonna fly right in there. So then we have these map, look how big these walls are. Look at that. Should I place one right there? Oh, it's amazing. That's gonna save our life an absolute ton of work. So I'm gonna get some stuff placed, get some walls put up, and then I'll bring you guys back. All right, guys, so we went ahead and finished up our building and let's go check it out. Holy crap, today has been a long day of building. So we covered the whole thing up. They're all walls that are 12 high, so that didn't take too long. We had to pillar it down. We had to make this one ugly pillar sticking out down here, but that's not that big of a deal. Uh, put one hatch frame on top so we can fly in. And we've got uh, a couple little up areas. So I figure we'll park flyers like Argents, Nemorphodons, Pteranodons, whatever. Maybe, can we fit Quetzals up there? Let's try. We should be able to fit Quetzals up there. If we go, if we go just go nose in. Yeah, Quetzals. They'll be sticking their heads out though. Maybe we can, I don't know. Maybe we'll, maybe we'll make these things a little bit deeper eventually, but uh, not right now. Right for now we're good. There should be tons of room in here to store dinos. So we just gotta move these suckers in there, build a couple troughs. Um, let's kind of see. Let's grab some. Let's start with our, uh, oh, is the Diplo gonna be too big? I was thinking we'll put everything in there except for like Brontos and stuff. But being that we don't have a lot right now, it might not harm just to throw the Diplo in there. Um, then again, I don't really care if he dies either. Let's see. Open sesame. Oh, he actually fits. Huh. But no, he's gonna take up way too much room in here. Any of the big guys, the sauropods, I guess they are called, will stick outside. We'll stick this guy just like right here. That's your home now, bud. This is where you live. Cool, so I'm gonna go ahead and get these guys all moved in. All right, guys, so we have got all of our dinos that we currently have at least moved in. Wait, was there another one over there? No, I thought I missed someone. Uh, so let's go check it out. I'm gonna have to, I think, I originally I wanna line the guys up along the sides like I have been. This trike is actually not mine, it's somebody else's. I'm just holding it for them. Um, so I've got plenty of room. These guys line up on the sides and we got our flyers up top. We got the Argent up top. We got the Demorphodon up top. Uh, we got the Quetzal over on that side. But I think I wasn't going to originally, but I think I'm gonna line guys up against this wall and make kind of some rows. The only reason I have a door on this side is one, so I could easily see out and see what's going on, like a cool little, uh, little window. But also, uh, so I can get flyers in from that side. And you know, that just makes things a little nicer than having to fly around every time. But for today, guys, I do think that is going to be it. If you did enjoy the video or if you learned something, do me a favor and hit that thumbs up button. And of course, if you haven't yet, please feel free to subscribe and share. Um, you can also check me out on all your social medias, your Twitter, your Instagram, your Facebook, and even your Google+, even though no one ever uses it. And you can actually check out my Patreon at patreon.com 
slash Obadiah X. Uh, before today, guys, I really do appreciate you coming to hang out with me. And until next time, I will see you later.